Today we're taking a look at the Navac valve core removal tool, the NV-R2. If you're an HVAC tech, you know how crucial a core tool is. So let's see what makes this one different. Right out of the box, the big standout is its versatility. This one tool works on both quarter inch and 5 16 cent flare fittings, so you don't have to carry around two separate tools. It's got a pretty high pressure rating of about 800 working PSI and can withstand a vacuum down to 20 microns. So that's the features, but let's see how it actually performs. I'm going to test the VCRT out on this simulated leaking service port. I use a plain service port cap with a hole drilled into the top and apply some big blue leak detector to verify the leak visually with bubbles. Okay, so once we've verified the leak, we can go ahead and mount the VCRT right onto the service port. A key tip, it's important not to over tighten it. If you crank it down too hard, you can compress the rubber O-ring, which actually makes it harder to extract the valve core. As you start to unseat the valve core, you'll feel pressure begin to push back against the remover. Don't stop there. That doesn't necessarily mean the stem is completely unseated. You'll often need to give it a few more turns to get it fully unscrewed. And just like that, the fail core is out. Now you can just replace it with a new one. And once that's in, perform the leak test one more time to make sure it's all sealed up. So, all things considered, the NAVAC NVR2 is a solid valve core removal tool. It threads on smoothly, it's effective at capturing the core, and it just works. You can learn more about the NAVAC valve core removal tool at hvacrschool.com slash NVR2, or you can pick one up at a supply house near you. And most importantly, don't forget the caps.